Hi guys, Mike Crossford here, more swing fixes coming at you, or swing ideas around the videos that people are sending me. Um, do remember, these are kind of ideas around patterns I see from students. Um, always advise going to get a one-to-one -one lesson. This is just hopefully giving you uh, a few ideas of how to maybe open your mind of how certain shapes and patterns might affect different impacts, but it always can be different for individuals. Um, let's give this guy some ideas and some help. Let's get stuck in. Interesting action here. Um, the way he puts force through the shaft on the downswing, so the top of the backswing and the downswing, follows an agenda that, if you like, I don't follow. Um, so if you change where I need to put the forces through the shaft on the downswing, so change kind of the goals, I would do what he's doing. What I mean by that, if I was to make a backswing where on the downswing I had to throw the club, there's a Cobra sign or Titleist Cobra Callaway sign over here, just off camera. If I had to throw the camera that way on the downswing, so literally like throw it, you know, like Lockie throws his clubs that way, um, I would do his backswing. So I would kind of go here, there, so I could start pulling on the shaft that way to throw it out towards that side, which is what he's doing it, throwing it that way and then swinging, which looks like quite heavily down to the left from what I can see from the 2D camera. So I want you to feel like you're putting some energies through the shaft in a different way. I want you to feel like you have to throw the shaft and the club, whichever part latches onto your mind better, in a different direction on the downswing. So I want you to feel on the downswing that you're gonna throw the club this side. So if 12 o'clock is here, six o'clock is here, I want you to throw it to two o'clock on the downswing, which is in the kind of right corner of this room for me here. So I want you to get to the top and feel like you're gonna throw the club that way. That uh, objective, knowing that's the goal on the downswing, often for people makes them make a different move on the backswing. It makes them start to feel that they might need to get kind of a bit more here opposed to where you're getting because your objective, your desire is to throw, to kind of offend the shaft that way, if you like. So changing the ideas of where you're throwing the energy through the club on the downswing might help you set back in a different way to achieve that goal, which in turn, if you were to throw the energy through the shaft this way, as if you're gonna throw the club back that way, definitely would have an effect on path in a more positive way. Um, so absolutely feel like you're gonna throw it that way on the downswing. I think you'll start seeing some very different shapes on the backswing. Oh, that's on the line. We, oh, that could go in. Oh, that was nearly in. Um, sorry, are we doing a video here? I want you to feel like you're throwing it into that corner. Oh, look at that, dead straight. Um, that way, get rid of this desire to throw it oh, that way. It's an interesting one. I would never work it out that way. I mean, I see people who make the backswing you're making, but they still would then try and throw the club that way. Um, yeah, get your feelings on that downswing and throwing it into that corner. It'll make a massive difference for you. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for loads more videos. Find me on Instagram at CrossfieldMark, also on Twitter at 4GolfOnline. Find me on Facebook, Mark Crossfield. Thanks for watching, post comments as always, and see you soon.